my God, look at the place. I, I, I was given to believe you were expecting me. Miss Holt's employment agency? Done right, honey, and not a moment too soon. <gasps> Allow me. Neat. Time. Six minutes past ten. <gasps> can I be of any further assistance? Not unless you can get Phil out of bed in the next two minutes, you can't. I've known my share of naughty boys who oversleep. You too, huh? Me. I can get your boy up and dressed in no time. You could, really? Certainly. Angel. One must not stand for any nonsense, that's all. They just need to know who's in charge. First door at the top of the stairs. Philip? Rise and shine, Philip. As I said to your mother, I won't stand for any nonsense. You naughty boy. Get up. I kind of am up, as you can see. <laughs> oh, <sorry. laughs> oh, Hello again. I'm awfully sorry about earlier. I thought you were someone else. That is some relief, I suppose. <laughs> Jolly nice to meet you, dear lady, but uh, who the devil are you? Who is she, gorgeous? She's, um... <laughs> you know, I'm not altogether sure. Pettigrew. Guinevere Pettigrew. Guinevere. Guinevere. Wow. Yes, but who is she? What in the world is she doing in this particular bedroom when you are so obviously starkers beneath that delightful gown, don't you know? We have an engagement. A meeting. Meeting. Important meeting. Indeed we do. In 22. 22. Not 22, Guinevere, dear. It's two minutes. What the dickens can be as important as another hour in bed with young Philip, me lad? Uh, you don't mind, do you, Guinevere? It's all a bit new to me, and it's devilish good fun. Uh, besides, I have nothing till lunch. Come back to bed, you <laughs> fool. <laughs> oh, baby, baby, I'd love to, but I can't. Oh, come on. It's awfully good cure for a hangover, I'm told. <laughs> Edith's lingerie show is at 11. Anyway, haven't you got to get ready? Who are you lunching? Oh, nobody really. Charlotte Warren? The rabbit? Why? She run out of carrots. Sweetie Pops. But you said the lead was mine, Phil, honey. You promised. It is, it is. I'm sure it is. You're the one, baby. I just have to clear it with Daddy, being the bounder with the checkbook and all, and, you know, he wants me to meet her. Amazing voice, apparently. Do you like air raid sirens? It's just lunch, darling. Come on, Delicia. Remind your producer why you're right for such a passionate part. Mm. 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 Charlotte Warren, the actress? No, her what? I just happened to see her last night on Shrewsbury Avenue. Who with? With A man. Producer. Hmm. Spivvy fellow. Hmm. Nasty side parting. Hmm. I knew it. Danny Ruddy Greenwood, dash it all on the poach. Well, we'll see about that. Oh, Phil, hmm. you can't think that Charlotte Warren is right for Hortensia. Not with that damp little nose. Uh, jacket? Behind you? A uh, uh, quick egg and I'm off. I regret for out of eggs. You know this? I'm afraid I do. Bacon? So sorry, no. Sausage? If only. Smoked haddock fillet? Definitely not. Toast! Ah, I saw the baker's girl deliver a loaf yesterday. Allow me. <clears throat> Guinevere, you've got to get him out of here. We're on a deadline. Toast is only two minutes. I realize it is not my place, but isn't it possible simply not to answer the door to this Nick fellow? Oh, I can't do that. Why? It's his flat. <laughs> 